Uh, Coach Ferentz has said several times, uh, he tells the NFL scouts, no one makes uh, more ca tough catches over the middle than you do. Uh, is that just a knack? Is that ha hand-eye coordination? Does that come from your baseball skills? Where does that come from? Um, I mean, it is. It, it's all just kind of natural as far as catching the ball. I mean, I've always been able to catch the ball. But, I mean, just learning how to, like, find open space and do that kind of stuff, that's kind of came along as my career has gone on. And I'm still trying to get better at it, but I've gotten a lot better from where I was a couple years ago. Now, family reunions, did you and George used to go out and throw football around as kids? And <clears throat> yeah, I mean, pretty, yeah. Pretty remarkable that now he's got six touchdown catches, you've got a ton of big catches. Funny how that works out, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, yeah, we always competed at all our whole family, all cousins and everything. Uh -huh. So as far as just us two, no, it was not just us two. It was like a whole bunch of guys, cousins and stuff. We always used to play and compete, football, basketball, anything. Would you say growing up maybe baseball was your sport? You thought that would be your sport? <laughs> yeah, I mean, up until high school, it was like my favorite sport. That's what I loved doing. Mm -hmm. and I loved playing football as well. But, um, yeah, I mean, that was, that was one of my main sports all the way through high school. So, I mean, I still love baseball to this day. Were you a, you were a pitcher, weren't you a pitcher? I pitched, yeah, but, I, yeah, I did pitch, but I was more of an infielder. Okay, yeah. like what, what position? Third. Third base? Yeah. Okay. Um, the hand-eye coordination I mentioned, how, how does that come in football-wise? I mean, yeah, I mean, when you when you have to go out there and, and make a tough catch in traffic or something, you, you mean you need to trust your hands, mm -hmm. trust your eyes, um, even just being able to feel like an onside or something like that, that's just all natural. You just have to go out there and just play it how you'd go out and just play in a baseball game or do something like that. So, I mean, it all transfers. I mean, basketball, too, with your hand-eye stuff. Yeah. So, I mean, you just got to go out there and just do what you've always done and kind of comes into play throughout games.